I'm Stephanie Essen, and this is IDC Weekly. Want to greatly enhance the look of your game with particles that collide, bounce, and interact with other objects? In this episode, we look at the features in Unreal Engine 4 that enable you to do all of this and more. By understanding lit particles, scaling for different hardware, and by using the provided performance patches, you can make some awesome improvements to your game. Let's take a look at Glorp, a small 1-4 to four player game that demonstrates how to get the most out of CPU particle systems with Unreal Engine 4. CPU particles in Unreal Engine 4 have many features above and beyond GPU particles, including accurate collision with level geometry and the ability to bounce off floors and walls. They can also light what's around them, creating more realistic effects as they move around the level. CPU particles also influence other objects, such as using gravity to move things in the scene. Glorp was designed specifically to showcase how to take advantage of the features in Unreal Engine 4 and how to best make use of CPU particles in a game scene. The game, along with the help of this guide, will help you get a grasp of it all. Within Glorp, there are three scenes to help you. The first, Glorp Main, features a small game that utilizes CPU particle systems to show off all the optimizations covered in the guide. The other two maps, Glorp Dynamic Test and Glorp Stress Test Lit, are for testing the optimizations and pushing the system as far as it'll go. The guide covers the DirectX 11 API submission thread, PhysX library optimization, the asynchronous particle tick, parallel particle collision, as well as outlining the performance improvements. Get the latest release of Glorp on GitHub, and the Unreal Engine 4 source code can be found in the links, and I'll see you all next Monday. Hey everybody, I hope you liked this video. If you haven't seen our other videos on the Intel Software YouTube channel, remember to subscribe and don't forget to leave us a little comment, tell us what other material you'd like to see, and chat with other enthusiasts who watch our shows. Thank you.